Hey, this is Apostle Rob Wallace of Embassy Christian Center, and I just want you to check out the healing power of God, how He heal people's backs and knees simultaneously. Minister Yolanda Shaw, she had a word of uh, knowledge. People, anybody that have back problems, I want you to come on, come on up. If you have back problems, amen. Okay, I want to pray for backs first. Uh, Myra, could you give me like some chairs? Myra and whoever else can help him. They can sit down. Okay, let's measure their legs. See if their legs are even. This leg is shorter than the other one. Okay. Oh, uh, am I missing somebody else? I'm missing. I need one more person. So now let me. I want to explain this to you all is that remember I was explaining when the Holy Spirit was released upon you you got everything you need the healing power is upon you it's in you and so when you pray you're just releasing faith you know what the thing that messes with you when you're praying with people praying for people it is your carnal mind your carnal mind tells you it's not going to happen it's not going to this thing. you got to rebuke that that's not you that's your carnal mind so what we want to do is we want to measure the leg. Whatever leg is short, we want to speak to it and command it to come out. Amen. And we're not going to make nothing up. Okay. I mean, lift up. You have to lift up both legs so we can so you can compare them to the other one. All right. Now I want you to repeat after me. And you have to fill in the blank. It's going to be blank leg. Come out in the name of Jesus. Okay. All right. So go ahead. Command it. her right leg needs to come out right right leg come out in the name of Jesus see it see it's even now you see it is even did you feel it you felt it is it even now put the heels together it's even all right praise the Lord is it even now? Okay. All right, stand up. Okay, now test your back. See what it feels like. <laughs> no, you're good. <laughs> There's no back pain? Now listen, I don't want y'all to make stuff up because y'all getting healed don't mean that you're less holy. Amen. <laughs> so if, it's not, if it still hurts, let us know. Because that's, look, I'm going to put it on them. It's their fault if y'all don't get healed. It's their fault. <laughs> so is the pain gone? Yes? Totally gone? You're totally gone? If your pain is totally gone, just wave your hand like that real hard. Okay, all right. Okay, so is he still praying for her? Okay. Praise the Lord. Father, put your hand on her back. Father, in the name of Jesus, I just command her back to be healed right now. That's it. Wow. Bones, I command you to go into place now. Alignment, proper alignment right now in the name of Jesus. Okay, test it out now. Fall out? <laughs> How's it? No pain? None. Okay, praise the Lord. Amen. She's like, I'm feeling good in my back and my head and everything else. Amen. On Father's Day. Okay. You know, we did healing and prophetic service, and Diane had her back prayed for it. She wanted to testify about it. It's kind of funny because um, Pastor called everyone up to come up for healing for back problems and then uh, high blood pressure. 
And uh, I've been having back problems for years, just off and on. And so uh, it had gotten really worse. Um, it had gotten to the point where at dinner time, I'd get up to wash the dishes and I was hunched over from the pain. And then the last three months, it was going down my leg, so I was kind of freaking out about that. And uh, I thought, well, he's calling people up for the back, and I have back problems. <laughs> I'm going to go up. So I went up, and they prayed for me, and I could still feel a little bit of pain on my lower back. And uh, the pastor said, does anyone, you know, feel any pain? I'm like, I still do. So they prayed for me again. And it's been two weeks and I haven't felt a single thing. Hallelujah. Yourself. Who, who saw Victoria Lindley? Okay. Amen. We're going to pray for her knee. You can leave it there. If you don't need a chair. Just go over there. What's the pain then? On a scale of one to ten. About a nine. Okay. All right. Come on. Yes. Mm. Is it down to a two? Okay. I still see. It's swell. Mm. That's your brace. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Father, in the name of Jesus, be healed now. Command all the pain out. So we go now. In Jesus' name, we command you to go now. In Jesus' name. Okay, check it out. It's gone. For a week, I had had fluid in my knee. Um, uh, just to let you know, I have a, a my plate, the little cap there, it's supposed to set straight, but mine is kind of tilted. Mm. So every now and then, I have fluid that comes up under that. And so for a week, I had fluid in the knee, and it went from the knee and all the way around, and it was just really, really painful and excruciating. So when I was here last Sunday, I had on my brace, um, but when they, when they all prayed for me, uh, the fluid left that night. It, it actually started going down during the, during church, but that night it was completely gone. All of the fluid was gone. The pain was gone. I was able to walk. I was able to bend. It has completely healed me. And I thank God because normally I would have to go, have to go and have an injection, get the fluid um, uh, expressed out, and it's very painful. So I thank God.